Hello, Andy here from buildahottub.com. In this video, we're going to look at hot tub plans, hot tub designs, and hot tub CAD, all important for your DIY hot tub project. Okay, so when you're looking to build your own hot tub, having the right plan and the right design is really important. If you get this bit right from the start, the rest, everything else will just follow through and it will make life so much easier uh, once you start laying blocks and fitting plumbing, that kind of thing. So what are the considerations then for the actual plan? Well, you should definitely have one to start with, whether it's a sketch on a piece of paper or whether it's a you know a more professional like we've got behind me here you know, 3d cad design that allows you to visualize and, and really understand what's going on with your hot tub either way you're going to need uh, to have a plan in place what's the shape of your diy hot tub going to be you know remember uh, if you're building out of blocks building things that are cylindrical uh, require a, a much greater skill level when when laying bricks and blocks than than building something square so if you're looking for something that's easier i would definitely plan to have a, a square hot tub how big is it going to be in terms of size you know how much space do you have available you know those are are really important because uh, if you add you know an extra foot onto the end or an extra foot onto the width it can add things like 20 percent onto the actual running cost so when you're planning and designing your um, your hot tub uh, make sure you take into account the size and don't make it too big um, really you know if if you think it's going to get on the large side just you know, rein rein your ideas in ever so slightly and it will save you uh, in the long run in, in your wallet how deep is your hot tub going to be um, in general most of mine have a water level of 90 centimeters which is just about 35 35 and a half inches and this height is the height up to the middle of the skimmer so remember if you're putting a skimmer in there uh, your water doesn't go all the way to the top the whole idea is that it flows through the skimmer and it can catch in the basket any uh, debris that's floating on the surface which wouldn't be the case if it if your water level was too high Okay, so water level height is important. How deep are your seats gonna be? How deep is the, the footwell? What's the height of your jets when you're, you know, when you're sat in the tub? I mean, something like that, you can actually you know, sit down on a seat, work out exactly where you'd like the jet to, you know, to hit you in the back, which is what I did when I built mine. You know, have somebody help you measure up to that position and there you have it you know you can put the the jet height and customize it so that it's perfect and um, for your you know for your own fit are you going to do all of the build yourself obviously if you have a, a sketch then that's great but if you're going to bring in some contractors to do maybe the uh, the brick laying or uh, or some of the plumbing work you you're going to want some uh, proper designs done up and that's where i can help um you know please do get in touch and, and i can turn those uh, those sketches into something that a professional contractor uh, can use to actually uh, you know make your build if you've liked this video please do like share and subscribe to the channel see you on the next video